All right, there's a new gentleman sitting here. I'm gonna go speak with this man. All right, guys, there's a new fellow sitting here with a bike. Looks pretty chilly. How you doing, man? Can't complain, I'm alive. What's that? I can't complain, I'm alive. Well, that's a bonus. All right. Um, would you like some warm coffee, sir? Yes, sir. All right, fantastic. I'm gonna set this up. Um, I don't know. Do you know these two young men over here? Uh, I don't know. Who's better than All right. Hey, I'll tell you what. If you stand up, I'm gonna go set this up at the end. I got some cups and I got coffee. And how you doing, guys? Good, sir. You guys want some hot coffee? Yes, sir. Jason. Yeah. How you doing, bud? Good to see you again. Good to see you. You got you a tent? Yes, sir. All right. Is this your friend here? Yeah. What's his name? I don't know. Brian. <laughs> Brian? I think I don't Brian, know. Jason. Yeah. Jason. Brian. So, you guys want some coffee? Yes, sir. Yeah, I just brewed it. My buddy Max made it. You know, he, he's got a house. Maxwell House. Um, that's a garbage bag. Yeah. But uh, here, grab a cup. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Grab a cup, sir. <coughs> you got one? All right. Uh, all you got to do is hold underneath, push down and hold it, and it'll fill up. You got to push down. Do the, yeah, pump out a cup. There you go. Yeah, I just brewed this like, you know, you you an hour ago. I do have socks today. Oh. Yeah. Would you like some? Oh, yeah. I think I may have missed those last time with you. Yeah. All right, I did. All right, I'll tell you what. But hey, there's creams and sugars, there's stirring straws in here, there's lids. Um, I want you to help yourself. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna get some socks for Mr. Jason. I'll go ahead. Yeah. I, know you can, you know, I can't hear you, buddy. Is there anybody you know who can come up with a sleeping bag or anything? I'm supposed to be getting some uh, some of that stuff here soon. I don't have an exact date, but Greater Works gives those out. You know, have you been down there? No, it's a long ways. <laughs> well, it's a long ways, but. I mean, what are you willing to do? Yeah, I'll go over it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'll go over it. Well, I'm just saying. You know, it's like, you know, you're you're out here for survival. Maybe he's not aware of the resources available to such. But, uh, yeah, man. Greater Works does a great job. They're a thousand times stronger than I am in regards to, you know, helping people. They're experts. I'm a novice. A novice at best. All right, Jason. Here you go, buddy. Now they're they're thin ankle socks. Oh, they were. Yeah, but they're brand spanking new, and uh, there's three pairs to you. What's nice about those is that there's no mixing and matching. You know, they're all the same. They're not purple. <laughs> they're not purple. <laughs> I guess it wouldn't matter. But check it out. I got some some hot hands, some some warming pads. Are you familiar with those? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to be getting some gloves and some. Uh, uh, some hats, you know, uh, knit hats, and uh, some sleeping bags. Um, just a lot of winter, winter items. You know, thermal socks. I'm gonna be getting those. You know, much thicker than those, obviously. But you need to get fixed up. They the right there, right over there. They, they, had a, they, they, they brought uh, blankets and stuff. You say was gonna bring them, and then they run them off, and they told them they ran all the, the Del Rey people did. Yeah, run the church as well. Del Rey, the Spanish Mexican owned restaurant or a uh, grocery store, yeah. ran ran off a, a church? When did this happen? So they were going to bring blankets to help you guys, and that, that business ran them off, said they can't be there. Yeah. Yeah. Is this a fact? Do you see it in person? Yeah, yeah, everybody else is. That is a crying shame, I, I must say. Here you go, buddy. Here's some hand warpers, man. It's 42. Bro. It's 42 degrees out. How you doing on stuff? I, I'm, I'm good, brother. Yeah. All right. Here you go, man. How are you, sir? Yeah, some hand warmers. It's like, um, I got a couple lunches. Are you hungry? Uh, yeah. Okay. I got two left. I just gave one out. I only had three for today because I was expecting to see one particular person here, but she's not here yet. Who's No, I just saw her. That's who I. No, I. I 
saw her a few times. Uh, I'm talking about Anetta. Is that, is that who that, that's who it was? That's no, that was. no, no, that was Dale. Yeah, it was Dale. Female Dale. Yeah. No, there's a couple. All right. You guys want to get a little refill on your coffee? Why don't you top it off? Still You're still full? All right, cool. Calls me down. Yeah, you, you got one. You're good to go. Yeah, it calls me down. <laughs> well, all right, guys. All right. Let me, uh, I guess I'll take this stuff away. I'll tell you what, I'll leave that garbage bag. You guys promise to use it? Yes, sir. Not throw it on the ground? Yes, sir. There's a Sprite bottle over there, you know. I'll tell you what, the first, first order of business is keep your area clean because otherwise you're going to attract attention. You know, that's just how it goes. I probably don't have to tell you. Yeah. Yeah. That was a big deal. That was a community back there. Yeah, that, that was me. They're like, you know, dog. I live at the top. We live above. They're like, we keep it clean, though. We keep it clean, yeah. though. They, they I've been through there many times. They never messed with us. They never messed with us, though. Yeah. Well, until the car wash got bought yeah. with all the land, so. I'm talking about the car. Mind them all. Mind them all. I'm talking about right here. Okay. Oh, behind the wall is a whole other story. Yeah, yeah. All right. I'm sorry, buddy. What was your name again? Danny. Danny? Yes, sir. Daryl, nice, nice to meet you, sir. Um, if you want to come over here, let me give you lunch. But I'll tell you what, why don't you stay here? I want you to be able to protect your stuff. Right. But I got a lunch made up for you. All right, thank you. So, you like peanut butter and jelly? Yes, sir. All right, I'll hook you up. Kool Aid? Yep. Uh, how about some peanut butter Ritz? Yeah. All right. Do you like Ray Tracing bars? Yeah. Well, I got none of that. I hate it. I got none of that. I'm like it. I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> today I don't have to worry about uh, or well at least at this time of day don't have to worry about getting smashed by a bus this place becomes a zoo it's pretty mad but you know it's the way it is that's the deal I'm going to set this young man up with some lunch for some reason he told me his name again but it doesn't seem like it's the same I guess I might be confused. I'll find out f more on further review of the video, which I have to do quite frequently. All right. Here you go, my friend. Yeah, there's a Kool-Aid pack in there, bag of chips, bunch of snacks. All right. Do you have any profound statements for the world? What would you like to let the world know? I haven't seen you before. No. How long you been out here? Not too long. About Not too long in like a month? About two or three months. Two or three months? Okay, this is the first time I've seen you here. Yeah. All right. What brought you out here, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, right now I'm just trying to get up money to keep my rent paid to keep my grandbaby with a roof over his head. Wow. Wow. I'm trying to get a job everywhere I go to put in an interview, I ain't got no way for them to return a phone call. And when I call them, they hadn't made a decision yet or whatever. So, so you don't have a phone to receive calls. No, what about you got you got ID and birth certificate and yeah. social security card and all that? Okay. What are your skills? I mean, I mean, what have you done? I mean, what kind of job are you applying for? Uh, I got forklift. Forklift driver. Okay. Yeah. I did that for quite a while. Cook. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. A few things. All right. So multifaceted. Yeah, I just ain't got, like I said, I ain't got no way for him to return a call. Okay. I keep checking with him or whatever. I'll tell you what, if you go down to Greater Works, because you said you needed some additional things, they might be able to set you up. Do you got, do you get food stamps? No, sir. Okay. Well, you'll be able to apply for them. You can, they haven't. If you have ID and stuff already, you can use them. They'll give you an address that you can use to get a food stamp card. With a food stamp card, you can get a phone. Right. Yeah. It's only three miles down the road. Right. You know, have you been down there at all, ever? A uh, long time ago. Okay, well, I guess the time would be now. Yeah. Winter's coming, friend. Oh, yeah. I don't got to tell you. Great. Yeah. We could see our breath. <laughs> you know, yeah, that's, that's no joke. 
you know. It's going to be a cold one this year. If you've only been out here a couple, two, three months, you haven't seen a winter yet. All right, well, you may be uh, uh, taken back by the effects of Mother Nature, right. is what I'm getting at. But uh, oh, yeah. I'll tell you what, today is Saturday. They're not going to be open. Um, I think they do might do a lunch, but they don't have like office people that you know help you out with the uh, paperwork type stuff. Okay. You know, so but uh, man, uh, let me give you a card. Well, it's probably not going to do much for you simply because you don't have a way to contact anybody. Right. But this is what I do. My email address is at the bottom. Okay. And if you need to get a ride or something down there, if you can borrow someone's phone. You know, send me an email, you know. All right. I'm just I'm just throwing that out there for right, you, man. Right. I appreciate it. But uh little thing help. Well absolutely, that's why I'm here. You know, it's kinda what I do. But uh all right man. I'm sorry to see you in this situation. Okay. So all I'll right. get better. Well I I like I like the thoughts, you know. You made it make it better though. Yeah. It, it is up to you to make it better, but uh, I'm here to help in you know any small way that I can. You know, just with a quick lunch and you know maybe some supplies. Right. How you doing on hygiene stuff? You say you're okay? Yes, we are now. Okay, fantastic. All right, man. But I'm going to be getting some winter stuff here soon. Uh, hopefully, I won't see you again. Maybe not. I hope not to be rude. You I know, I, I hope you know what I'm trying to say. It's like oh, yeah. if I never see you again, that might be a good thing. Right. You know. Uh, hopefully, uh, I'm not reading about you, in the, you know, in the paper. No way. <laughs> so, all right, buddy. Yeah, good one. All right, thank, thank you, you, sir. Yeah, it's a pleasure to meet you. You too. Okay. All right. Well, you can talk to a multitude of people. Uh, Jason, I met once. The other guy I've never met before, kind of like you with you today. But you can ask anybody around. My name is Daryl. All right. Yeah. Two R's, two L's. All right. So, yeah. You know, there's some veterans that hang out here, and I'm here quite often. You know, two, three days a week. Yeah. So, but uh. Sometimes there's lots of people here. Sometimes there's nobody. You know? Yeah, I've been up here a couple times. There've been a lot of people. Yeah, yeah. And you're fighting for territory, and <laughs> you know what I mean. It's like, well, I'll stand ten feet this way, and you stand ten feet that way. You know. Right. So, you know, you get it. Yeah. All right, buddy. All right. Well, I'll let you get back to it. Um, are you holding a sign of any type? You got a sign? I got one. I just ain't started holding it. Okay. Let me see that. You got that on a tiny piece of cardboard. Well, at least you can almost read it. No, almost. You almost have to be next to them to show it to them. Yeah. But, uh, all right. It'll well, work, I hope. All right. You getting any trouble with the law? No. I mean, I'm, I mean, talking like, you know, they, they've been pressing you for, you know, no, trespassing or anything? Me too much, yeah. Okay, good, good. Fantastic. Good for you. They just uh, stopped me on my bicycle a couple times because I didn't have no lights. Yeah, I see you got a light now, yeah. I got some on there now. Nice. Somebody gave them to me. Good for you. Good deal, sir. All right. Well, at least you got a bike. I found that one in the dumpster. That's a, those are 29 inch. That's a 29 inch bike, isn't it? Uh, it's a 1973 JC Penny. 1970, but I'm talking the the. Oh yeah, yeah. I think it's a 29. Yeah, it's pretty big. Yeah. Well, you're a tall guy. Yeah, 6'2", yeah. 6'3". Yeah. Nice. Well, don't beat me up. Yeah. <laughs> like, like all right. Hey, get into that, man. Oh, yeah. There's a peanut butter and jelly. Uh, there's a spoon in there. You can spread it out however you want. All right. And, uh, you know, if you're hungry, you know, you got to get some energy in you. <laughs> some fruit. There's some fruit snacks. All right. Um, you know. Different things. Yeah, sorted, sorted items. You know. Yeah. Pick and choose. So. All right, young man. All right. some lazy turtle chip. Yeah, I'll be back in a, you know, like I said, I'm here quite a bit. I'll be back in a, you know, a couple days. And All right. If, if I see you again, is it okay if I stop and talk to you? Yeah. Fantastic. All right. Oh, yeah. Good seeing you, friend. Be safe. All right, man. You be safe. Oh, yeah, I got you. You know, my hands are chilled to the bone. My fingers are turning color. <laughs> thing. But I will have some gloves and hats. All right. You know, cover your ears and, you know. Keep you little thermal and thermal socks. All right. You know, the Bulldog family's helped me out. <laughs> so, all right, I'll talk to you soon. All right, thank Maybe. You. Maybe. All right. all right, buddy. Take it easy. Oh, boy. Wow. 
tell the truth, he looks like a good friend of mine. His name was Mark. I mean, this goes back 25 years. They could be twin brothers, I swear. The point is, it's like, look. And here's the police. I'm gonna have to put this on. I'm gonna be back, guys. I still got a, you know, half a tank of coffee. I guess you could say it's eight cups. No, I'm sorry, six. My little coffee pot thing holds 12. So I got about half, I'd say. And uh, I'm going to go from there. So until we meet again, my friends.